Hi everyone! Today, I'm going to show you in my new kitchen. So, it's a kitchen tour and I'm gonna show you inside my cupboard how I organize my kitchen. So, yeah, we had a barbecue this afternoon. So, I have now no pots and pans um, lying around. So, yeah, so I thought i would show you around my kitchen and what's inside, how I organize and how I use all the storage that I bought in the range home bargains in Poundland. So yeah, let's get started with the kitchen tour and organization ideas. Please bear in mind my kitchen is not fully done yet. We needed a, uh, a floor tile so floor is not done yet and we need a skirting board because my husband can't do the skirting board until the he put the tiles. We can't buy it because Bay and Q is closed. So yeah, we we don't we didn't want to order online because uh in case it doesn't look good in person if you know what I mean. So at the moment, just ignore the flooring. Guys, I'm going to start in this area. So, I'll show you the before of my kitchen. So, you could um, um, see that we haven't got this before. So, our, our cupboard is just up to here. So, I gained this bit. I gained that bit. So, yeah, which I'm so happy. So, yeah, guys, I'm going to start in this um, area. So, at this um, area, I've got my coffee station. So, yeah, we got the kettle, old kettle. I didn't buy a new one. So, in here, in this, um, from the range, storage, I put my coffee decaf for my husband. And this is for me as well, decaf. We have our sweetener. Just So, yeah, very simple. That's it. That's in this area. 
yeah. But sometimes it's get messy when there's plates and the shopping. So, um, it's it's nice to maintain it like this. That's how it looks like. And at the bottom of this, we have this cupboard. So I have the glasses. The glass of my husband here. That's what he used. And we actually bought this um, this glass. I bought this one in the car. Uh, 50p. I bought six at first. And then uh, we bought some more. When we found it again in the car. But it's, it was only 50p each. So yeah. And then we got a different. Um, the plastic ones. That we bring upstairs. If we needed a drink. Yeah that's what we use. So we don't need to bring the glass. I got, at the back I've got my Poundland wine glass. But I've got the rest of my wine glass that my marks and spencer one in my other um cupboard and here are all my mugs at the next level which you've seen last time and here i have all my saucer and a, a side plate and i got my serving plate i got another one of this but uh yeah we're using it at the moment so i got my bowls my plates and the plates of the boys i just um tried to fit everything so that's why it's really packed because i just want to put all the plates in this um cupboard so yeah bowls and the bowls of the boys so yeah that's in this cupboard which i'm really happy because um yeah it did fit everything going to close this um cupboard now so next to that one is my washing machine and then this is my sink area so you've seen it in my um i'll link it down below if you haven't seen it my uh how i organize my under the sink cupboard so here's my top which i absolutely love and this one excuse this one guys it hasn't been uh done yet it needs to paint the wood um that's around it we haven't got the paint yet because um you know it we are on a lockdown and this one needs to stick together so yeah that's why it's not done yet so anyway i got my belfast sink um i'm just gonna show you this one quick there's a bit of changes yeah it's just because i bought a new elbow grease and i i added this one i put some of my sponges that i use for cleaning so yeah that's it really oh this one it's annoying me guys because it won't fit my um it won't fit there anymore so i don't like something hanging around in there but yeah and this one actually i want to put it in here once this one is finished i'll put it in there so it's not like just in there if you know what i mean so yeah a link down below if you haven't seen it yet under the sink how i organize it so that's that and so that's that's the and i'll um next one is this cupboard so yeah i put the for the boys to dry their hands for everyone for the family to dry our hands because it won't fit as i said before it won't fit in there it's too short so yeah it's perfect here and the boys knows already where to dry their hands so i'll open this one and here how i organize in this area is i've got the squash in here and i put it in in the range is storage so all they have to do they have to pull it out and then get the squash this is always in the front because that's what the boys like they don't like the bimto but me and my husband likes this and at the back of that i got my where i put my this is my tumbler i put my chia seed drink and at the back is my zoella which i don't use a lot so it, it, i put it in there at the back so that's that all they have to do is pull it and get this and then and this next to that one is all the drink um the tumbler of the boys their bottle so my eldest son knows how to make his own drink and he makes the our youngest son so they just he just get their bottle here so that's all theirs and next to that one are all the travel mugs of my husband that he takes to work i got two for myself and he has those two tall glass that it won't fit on the other cupboard so he all his tumbler are there so yeah he only got two i actually he got three i think he's using it at the moment so i put it just here in the front if it's 
if if it's in here but it's perfect i throw some of their bottle because it's it won't fit here and i don't want um over it's that it will be overflowing i got nowhere to put so i it's too much anyway this one and at there on the other side is all the for the pack lunches the lunch box yeah where they put their sandwiches for uh pack, pack lunch so yeah i put it in there so it's easy for me to grab in the mornings if there's a school so yeah that's perfect i throw some of them as well i just made make um that it will fit in this uh, the range is storage clear clear storage again so yeah all i have to do is just do that and grab one and in this one my husband uses this all the time so i put it in there it's a glass so i'm always being careful and all this bowl we need i needed it when i defrost meat and yeah so just just those ones and i just put that one there and here are just like great for grated grating the cheese bits and pieces this is to make the patty for the burger yeah so i just put the miscellaneous things in there so it's nice and tidy so that's the at the bottom guys how i organize in this area are my pots and pans so it's in there the big ones small ones are all on top of each other and then in here are all the lead Yo, I'm really happy with this one. It's from the range as well. Yeah, that's all the lid in there. It still can fit one or two in there. So, yeah. And here are all my baking tray. They're all together, stuck together. So, perfect. And I throw quite a lot as well, but we don't need all of them. So, I just I just left. I just kept what we need. So, yeah, we got um a few. So, that's that in this cupboard so you see guys i like how i organize my things because i just left what we need if you know what i mean so let's shut this this cupboard and then guys in this one i will show you real quick so this is what i bought from the range to organize all my cutlery and on this side so it looks tidy i put all the kids um actually it's noah always uses this and he knows how to get his spoon and fork in here so that's perfect i got at the back the medicine for the medicine and the ice cream and then this is to measure the pasta so yeah so that's all for noah and for my eldest boy but most of the time he uses the adult one now so that's that second drawer so i've got all my stuff for cooking the scissors the whisk yeah everything are in here it's easy to grab guys when i'm cooking i just open it i have my bread in here yes bread bread roll this one i have my new toaster which you have seen on my whole amazon haul i bought it in amazon so that's that and then second level i got all my uh what the foil my plastic things y'all cling film my eggs and these are for our spread nutella marmite peanut butter yeah so that's that and i got my oven glove here it's dirty sorry so all i have to do is pick it up my husband knows where to get things now which is so good in this area oh my god guys look how i organize this so if we are cooking and we need an oil all i have to do is just pull it out i'm so happy with this guys i got my olive oil i got vinegar i got my oil spray in there so overview so you could see and then next one guys all i have to do is pull it again i've got my salt my pepper and all the gravies i have in there so that's all the gravy and the, um, there's a pepper again in there so yes and then because i don't use this a lot I, that's mine so i got my pelifino stuff in there so yeah look i got my sardine this is not a pelifino brand but i got my sardines my tuna so yeah i got a, so a spare soy sauce in there that's my chia seed and then at the back of that i got my um kitchen oh i got a apple cider vinegar here hiding in 
here. So yeah, kitchen um gadget at the back. And at the bottom, guys, all I have to do, this is all mine. All I have to do is pull it out. So these are all my three ingredients, Filipino uh, ingredients that I always use. Vinegar, fish sauce, and soy sauce. And I have my spicy spicy oil lemon soy sauce soy sauce so all i have to do is pull it out and all at the back in there is my spare vinegar is there all my all the kitchen gadget of my husband my, his juicer um sandwich maker and loads of different kitchen gadget all the way to the back guys so yeah but in here so we could always uh we always we can always grab what we need what we always use is are in here so yeah because we don't use all those kitchen gadget all the time so it's in there so that's that yeah so and then that's my oven and here we have our um microwave and this washer Guys, so in this area is my freezer. I'm going to link down below my fridge and freezer tour. So nothing changes, only it's less food from the last time. So yeah, I'll link it down below if you haven't seen it yet. Uh, guys, I'm on my ladder now. So on the very top of my fridge so i have all the um the tupperwares in here so i got these are all the lids if you could see and these are all the you know the, the at, and at the back i have the that we use for cinema which we don't use a lot and the other ones that we don't use a lot so all in this one are the one we use all the time so yes i'm happy that there's um i gain storage in here but before you could um uh, how do you call this one before you could get to this one you need to open the the fridge so that's that and then guys we are going into this cupboard so i'll open it oh my god i'm so proud of this one guys because it took me two days to organize everything two and a half days almost three days so from the top overview so these are all my old storage guys i just reuse them again because it per it's perfect perfect size these are all the range this is poundland so on the top guys i will go up all my sauces and all i have to do is pull it out look at it guys it's super look at look at it guys it's super nice yeah and then here are oh guys i'm sorry so here are all the there's some noodles and some pasta all i have to do is pull it out if i want something if the boys needed something and here are actually this is overflowing it's meant to be only like that but my husband bought this one the other day so these are the rice of my husband and there's a tuna at the back so all i have to do is pull it out i'm so happy and guys at the back of that i'll take this one out those are my low carb um low carb ingredients to make a bread but i haven't been using it so it's right at the back there if i'm on a diet again i'll just have to to get it from there so yeah so that's that guys and then on the second level are just like a noodles and i have the gravy there at the it's like a cheese cheese one that cheese sauce that we haven't uh, we don't use all the time so all the one that at the back are the one that we don't use all the time are uh, here are like the coffee coffee of my husband some uh gravy that are new and peanut butters that are new yeah and these ones are some sardines lemon rice pudding mustard so yeah so that's there and here are the baked beans i'm going down to the second level so we have a baked beans and tuna so yeah at the back we have a chopped tomato which we don't use a lot so it's at the back we have all the pasta sauce in here so look guys yeah all i have to do is pull it out we got um branston 
pickle. We don't use it all the time. So, it's at the back. Corned beef at the back. And here are all the puddings and some salad sauce. So, jelly, custard. Oh, custard. Jelly, jelly, jelly. Yeah. My husband's. The, at the back is um mango chutney. Pesto sauce. Yeah. So, that's that, guys. That's my review. Oh, I'm so happy with this one, guys. I'm so, so proud of this. We are in this cupboard now, guys. So, I'll open the... This one is the range hood. So, let's close that. And here, my husband accidentally put it in the wrong place. This one. It should be in here. So, when you open it... But, yeah, it's fine. It doesn't affect me because I don't open this all the time. So, yeah, I've got this one. We only use this for Christmas to put the peanuts and stuff like that. So, I put it in there and I got my... Me my uh, cherry mental sweets in there i got the coffee in here that it won't fit in here so i put it in there for now so yeah i got my decaf and that one is for my husband that's it in there so let's open this one guys not very uh organized in this one i got my sugar because we don't use it all the time i got a pasta pasta from this is home bargains storage and here when i'm cooking all i have to do is pull it out i have all my uh stock cubes chicken vegetable beef so yeah and then and this one are all my tea so all i have to do i wanted this one on the top but it won't fit in there so yeah um all my tea at the back is a like a normal tea if we have a visitor who who drinks tea and then this one is empty because it's meant to be for coffee but we don't use it for coffee so yeah these are all my tea which i don't i i drink them sometimes you know in this level guys are all the baking stuff of my husband this is my old storage this is poundland so yeah this is the boys cake paw patrol uh, yeah for all for baking and on the top this is the one from the range again are all for baking so yeah yeah weighing scale in there and then in here all i have to do is pull it out but i have to use a ladder uh the pasta so yeah we don't use it all the time so i put it right there because it won't fit it won't fit in actually it does fit but i don't know why i put it in here lasagna pasta yeah because we usually use this all the time pasta for pasta bake so that's why i think i put it in there and this one is empty i don't know yet what to put i put my gravy boat in there and guys this one that you could see is the stairs so yeah i don't know yet what else to put in this one so that's in there guys you have to close yeah it's not full yet i have to buy some more of this in poundland when the lockdown is lifted so i want to put it i want to transfer this into the same like this and put some more if you know what i mean so it's nice and uniform oops what happened there ah there so we are finished in this guys we are on the last two cupboard so in this cupboard i have my i am happy with this guys i have my all my chopping board and they're perfect and i have trays there as well i have my trays there i only got two i threw away some so yeah but it's perfect there and we don't really use um tray and here i have my coffee another coffee so this is the one guys that i bought from the range so yeah i got uh the coffee ground in there so i just kept it in there there like that and then guys in here this is my last cupboard to show you are my medicine cabinet so i'm using all that um storage from the range 99 ph that's the kids um, all the medicine of the kids, syrup, our paras, our tablets, some more tablet, and for the adults on the top. So that's that. I was stressed out what to put in this cupboard because look how tiny it is, guys. So I have three of them, but I'm so happy with what I did to that. And this is the boiler. The boiler. At the bottom of that, guys, are this one. That's why it's a box is all the pipes of the boiler so my husband made it into a box this one can be pulled out so if there's a problem with the boiler 
he could pull it out and fix it. So yeah. Guys, I'm absolutely sweating. So that's it for my kitchen tour. I hope you enjoy it. And I'm so sorry if it's too long. But yeah. Um, I'm going to give you a tour again once my dining is done and all the flooring. So thank you so much everyone for watching and uh, please leave on the comment down below what do you think of my new kitchen and the storage and how I organize my kitchen. I love reading all your comments and thank you so much for watching and I will see you on my next video. Stay safe. God bless. Bye-bye.